It's a new season. New season has come upon us as a ministry and as a people. And God is ready and willing to do mighty things in our lives even as we start the 40 days prayer and fasting comes June 25th all through to August 3rd. Can you imagine what God can do in your life, in our campuses and across the nation when we unite in prayer and fasting? Whether you're on campus or at centers across Nigeria, we have a powerful journey coming up. A dedicated time of fasting and prayer is a dedicated time to seeking the Lord. It's a dedicated time to meeting with the Lord. It's a dedicated time to growing in leaps and bounds in things relating to the Spirit. God speaking in the Bible says, I have not asked the house of Jacob to seek me in vain. I want you to build on expectations knowing that you are not going to be seeking the Lord in vain. You know, it's a time to wait on God, to trust God and to pray together as well. The Lord that you'll be seeking is very much waiting and ready to meet with you. Surely there's an end and the expectation of the righteous will not be cut short. Build that expectation because the Lord is ready to meet you at the point of your need. I want to encourage all our youth to please participate in this spiritual exercise. It promises to be a great time. Bible says that those that wait upon the Lord, He will renew their strength. They will mount up with wings like eagles, and they will, they will run and they will not be weary. So this is a time to wait on God. Bible says that we should remember our Creator in the days of our youth. This is a time to, you know, it's to, to use our time to for the things of God. And I trust that God is a, is a, He honors His word more than His name. And He's going to honor his word in our lives as we do so this is your moment to draw closer to god and seek his face and experience his transformative power this is not just an event it's a moment of faith prepare your heart mark your calendars and get ready to embark on this spiritual journey together we can't wait to see you there let's see god's face and witness his glory like never before this time around, I want to let you know, it is not another prayer and fasting, but it is the prayer and fasting where God will be visiting us mightily. You remember in Matthew chapter 17, verse 21, Jesus said, however, this kind does not go out except through prayer and fasting. And so God will be dealing with all of these kinds of issues in our lives, all of these kinds of infirmities, all of these kinds of diseases, all of these kinds of delay, all of these kinds of financial issues. And God wants you to be ready because he really wants to bring judgment upon all this kind. So I want you to get set, get your vessel prepared and take part in this 40 days prayer and fasting because God will be visiting us mightily. God bless you.